and welcome back to the channel. Today we shall be making a working Lego supermarket checkout. There will be an axle at the back that will allow you to turn the conveyor belt and you can put anything on top of it. You could even put your Lego money, put it on top and it will start moving along and it will fall down for your cash worker to check it out. So let's get straight in to this build. First of all, you will need a 4x12 and a 4x4 four four plate and a 1x2 and stick these pieces together so that it looks like this. Now you need a 1x16 thin and you already need a piece and stick it here. Just so that it looks like this. You will now need six of the 1x2s and two blocks tall and you already made piece and stick them at the side and going all the way around the back so that it looks something like this. You will now need your ready made piece, a wheel piece and a um, axle with an axle holder on the back, another axle with a hook and a turning piece. So if you get your axle and turning piece, slot them together like this on your axle holder so that it looks like this. You will now need a 1x2 piece and a 1x2 with a hole and stick it just like that and your axle and stick it through like that and get the wheel bit stick it onto the end so that it turns like this you will now need both of your ready-made pieces and remove this piece here and slot that in there just like that you will now need another wheel piece a 1x2 with a stick out, a 1x4 and a 1x2. So if you get your 1x4 and 1x2, stick it there like that, and your 1x2 with an axle, and stick it there like that, and get your ready made piece, and stick it there just like that. Now you can get your wheel and ready made. Remove this back piece that we have just put on and stick the wheel onto it so that it now looks something like this. Now if you get a conveyor belt, hook it on just like this and loop it on to your other wheel. You might need to remove one or two pieces to do so, but it is straightforward enough. And then you can hook it on to the back here, just like that. You can now get a two by four brick and two one by twos and stick them onto the back just like that and a long tile a one by two and a one by two with a hook stick them on top of each other and get your tile stick it on top and then hook them together like this now if you get your ready made piece and slot that into there so that it now looks something like this. 
You can now get a 1x4 of the st studs on the side and on the top, a 1x2 with vents, a 1x2 with a hook, and a 1x1. So if you get your 1x4 and stick your 1x1 onto the end and your um, hook piece and stick it here. Now you can get a 1x3 flat and a 1x1 and stick it on top just like this and your ready made piece and stick it on just like that. Now you can get your two ready made pieces and stick it just like that and a window piece stick it there just like that. Now you can get a computer screen and two one by two flat pieces. Stick your two flat pieces together and stick it onto the bottom of the computer and get your ready made piece and slot it in to the gap so that it now looks like this. We are nearly finished this creation so stay tuned to the very end. You will now need three one by ones and you're ready made and stick them one here another one into here and another one not just yet and stick your other one right there now you will need a one by four and a two by four and if you stick it just like that, get your ready made creation, stick it there and now if you want to you can cover all of this up so that it looks like this. Now you have your very own working Lego cash register. I hope you liked this video, if you did smash the like button and subscribe to my channel. Right now you are watching Brick by Brick. But tomorrow when I post, it will be called Tiny Plastic Bricks. So now you will be able to find this channel again. I hope you liked this video. If you did, remember to come back and subscribe. Goodbye.